the grown up sanya has received a lot of love from her fans but what were you as a child like we need to know that that side of you i was quite a drama queen when i was a kid too yeah. i always wanted to become an actor i think subconsciously i knew that this would be a perfect career for me you know yeah. i was quite dramatic as a kid i was very 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 naughty actually i used to come up with like random things i used to do plays uh in school i used to dance at every birthday party every shaadi <laughs> was quite an entertainer and that acting ka kheeda was always there in my head and i knew that i always wanted to become an actor and you've had your own challenges in the city from sharing a house with seven people to buying your own flat at is one quite point, an achievement at one huh? point there were 12 people okay at home i remember and i used to tell my uh, roommates and we used to joke about कि एक धर्मशाला खोल लेते हैं जो आता है हमारे घर पे तो रहता ही है क्योंकि हम बड़े मतलब बहुत बड़े दिल वाले थे सबके साथ क्योंकि कोई भी आ रहा है दिल्ली से कुछ काम नहीं है कहीं रहने की जगह नहीं है तो हम बुला लेते थे कि कोई बात नहीं यू कैन कम स्टे विद अस एनी टाइम बट हैविंग योर ओन हाउस इन दिटी एट सच एंग एज दैट्स क्वाइट एन अचीवमेंट रियली I'm I'm honestly very proud of that fact I am very grateful that you know I've got my own place now you know like it's very difficult to get a place in mumbai yeah. you know it's a hassle and that whole rent system finding a place every uh, in a, in every 11 months to thoda zyada ho jata tha but i'm very grateful thank you <laughs> ki now i have my own place my parents can come visit me any time they want to it just feels very good it feels I've, i'm very proud of myself yeah. <laughs> to achieve and you know how do you look back at your career it's quite uh, you know interesting the kind of different characters that you have played in such a short span of time actually i think i'm very very lucky natasha you know i always had those hopes and those dreams when i was starting off as an actor these are things these are experiences that are beyond my imagination you know i think i'm very lucky to have worked with some really good directors i can't believe that i have done a film with vishal bhardwaj bhardwaj nitesh tiwari uh, ritesh batra and all the other directors that i'm going to work with i feel i'm very lucky and the kind of characters that i uh, get to play uh, i just feel very grateful that these directors and these uh, creators really trust me as a performer and uh, that sort of gives me that confidence too and i think that this as i said this is something that is uh, had not imagined you know i'm really living my dream life and uh, most of your characters have a lot of prep behind them which is visible you can't just show up on set especially your first film of course dangal starting right from there yeah so all is that something you've kind of gotten used to you know because each character requires a certain amount of time and you know you just have to cut off from the world and just become that character so something that i love to do as an actor which is prep doing my homework i i'm quite nerdy that way and i can go all crazy when i'm prepping for a film also you are right because i saw um how fruitful that was during dangal you know we really got that time that liberty to you know get to know our characters well also step in their shoes and physically and mentally transform ourselves to be to be babita on screen and audience could relate to it they saw that hard work that we put in so i know for a fact that when you do your homework right uh-huh. um and when you convince yourself that you are that character it's very easy for the audience to also connect with it so this is something that i do it for all my films like i do not go on set without my homework like yeah. i can't i can't function that way actually i did for ludo i didn't do any homework but uh-huh. that was refreshing too and i had to completely surrender and trust i obviously i have so much trust in anurag dada i have i was like okay fine i just have to listen to him and uh, do what he is telling me to do on screen subscribe to midday india get direct notifications on all our videos by clicking on the bell icon